What is going on guys? Welcome to Family Reaction. My name is Chris. My name is Lucy. If you're new to this channel, welcome. Welcome. As you can see, everything looks a lot more different, a lot more professional. Yes. And of course there's the space here in Tin more K for the silver play button. <laughs> He's getting very excited and about now, it. Now, 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 it's, now it's happening. It's mm -hmm. happening. Today we will take a look at a trailer. The called... much awaited George Reddy. Yes, you all say, please do George Reddy now, now, now. So here it is. And I That's think we should just happens. do it. <laughs> it's, mine's broken. <laughs> all right, are you ready? Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Radiation is taking over. Poor staying poor and rich becoming richer. Being against this, we have raised our voice to protest. But our protest has remained unheard. What you say? Bam. Now he's pissed. He does some for us Everyone knows his name. Singh. Anybody can solve this? George Reddy. Isn't it? Yeah, I'm going to say that. One year, I'm going to say that. I'm going to say that. I'm going to say that. Bam, bam, bam. George Reddy Dada in Dana College. Damn boy. Outer Slope and Crowell and Tennis by Pertaner. Antigua Koshi. Upper Castante, a salary is going to go to the next. A silly devil by year. Nanagaka Monucci. Scholarship Pulrakunda Chesna. Chesna said a gala. Revolution. Yeah. Someone has to meddle if you want change, right? <laughs> Riot time! Riot! <laughs> Sounds epic. <laughs> oh, yeah. George Reddy. Definitely a man of action. Gina Heto Marnasiko! Giovanni Reddy. A man of action. You know, I couldn't hear anything you were saying. No, I know, I know. I was going to say, sorry if I'm shouting, it's a new experience to have headphones on, but actually not just a better experience for them, it's actually a much better experience for us. It's yeah. really cinematic. Like, you can just hear, like, the quality of sound for us. Like, I'm just so much more immersed in what I'm watching, which yeah. is amazing. You got drawn a lot more into oh it. Oh my gosh, crazy, having man. that sound. I mean, obviously yeah. it's better for you guys. You won't have, like, such a weak sound. It will sound much, like, thicker and nicer. No, 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 they're, they're, what they will hear is the, the original. The actual original. That's what I mean, yeah. so it won't sound as thin as when we do it you know exactly. because it's a mixture so they'll get the original sound but um yeah no i i loved it really really good especially for something like this that's all about like you know revolution and change and you know whatever being kind of like having that amazing sound makes yeah. such a difference right exactly but at the same time it makes me shout sorry i'm being very annoying i think i'll get used to it but um yeah <laughs> no no i i, I was shouting too but yeah. it's because uh, you don't hear yourself no i know which is like oh my god <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like you don't have to yell, we're right here. Yeah. yeah. Doesn't matter! Hi! <laughs> we're new to it now with the headphones. Yeah. Now, now we're new, 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 uh, newbies. Yeah, newbies. Exactly. We're newbies. We need to get used to it. No, I, to be honest, George Reddy was really amazing to watch. Yeah. It was it was a really amazing uh, trailer. Um, mm -hmm. And yes, with the headphones, you 
become more into it, you know? You get more yeah. into the trailer and you're just like, fuck yeah, man. Yeah, like, sorry if I laughed at some bad points. Like, I know the guy was saying, you know, no food and we're poor and poverty. I was just laughing because when you see George suddenly coming in, you know, and like, it's like that revolution, he's walking forward and fighting and it's just like, whoa, it makes you like excited. You know, it's like, yay, someone's gonna bring about change. And I know, unfortunately, as much as we hate violence, it's, well, the biggest and a lot of like very important changes happen because of a revolution, right? That's what I said. And you have to do it, and someone has to do it, and someone has to make the change. And um, George Reddy, obviously, being a, well, George, I should uh. say, um, being a boxer, well, you know, he's um, definitely the one to get a kind of army behind him, if you want to say. Isn't this you know? saying violence doesn't solve everything? Well, it doesn't. Like, I feel really bad to say this because I don't believe in violence and I believe love wins always. But sometimes, you know, particularly if you've got like a, a certain government, you know, one that maybe is very uh, stubborn and, you know, if you're not in a, you know, democracy or something, then unfortunately, um, sometimes violence... Ugh, I hate to say violence the only way it's a horrible thing to say because that so is not what I stand for. But revolution, you know, you do have to have a revolution. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So it's one of these really hard things. It's kind of, you know, I don't believe in it and I wish everything was solved through love and most things can be. I agree that love like wins and actually you yeah, know, yeah, yeah. kill people with kindness. But in certain situations, you have to have a revolution, yeah, I but, think. But honey, but honey, look at okay, people okay. die, of get, course. Get into the real world. We are in the real world. We're not yeah. in a fantasy, right? Um, people that says um, violence doesn't solve everything, they need to wake up. Mm. Because honestly, like, look at the world we are in, right? What George Reddy is doing is what he had to do to to uh, mm. to stop to stop certain things, you know? It's it's a revolution, as we say, mm. and it will happen again and again and again. Because look what happened in America, first of all, right? Mm. For no reason, just because they're cops, they think they can go and shoot whoever they want. Mm. I, I warn everyone. Just take a look in the TV. Soon enough, you will see every civilian will stand up and shoot all the cops. Just wait and see. Mm -hmm. Because they're It takes tired. one person to start it, and then if they get enough following, then you get a revolution, exactly. basically. And, it and will then happen. you can overthrow. And that's how big changes come about, and it has to happen, you know? Yeah, because in my opinion, remember when, when America said, we are the greatest country in the world. No, you're not anymore. Mm -hmm. You are not. That title is lost, and Land it will. Of dreams no, and yeah, hope. Exactly. That 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 country is dead. Okay. Well. Uh, no, no. I'm serious. With with mm. shitty leaders they have, um, and all these uh, law enforcement they have, right? Killing innocent people all the mm. time. <laughs> Kiss my ass. You're not the greatest country in the world anymore. Kiss my ass. Mm -hmm. uh, no, I. You know what? I have always wanted to you're live in America. You're not the land of dreams. You're I the have... land of horror. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I've always wanted to live in America. But you know what? I would be too afraid to live there. Everybody wears guns. Everybody have guns everywhere. I wouldn't live there. I would be too afraid. And the problem is if everyone else has a gun, then you have to have a gun. This yes. is the problem. That's what they you said. You can't break the yeah. cycle because, yeah, if someone has a gun, well, you have to have one because you have to protect your family. So, yeah. yeah. One said that to me as well. Uh, he said, yeah, oh, well, over here in America, you have to wear a gun. Then I said, you don't have to. And he said, you have to, otherwise you die. Then I said, no, you have to wake the fuck up. You don't need to wear a gun to protect yourself. You don't. Mm -hmm. If you get shot, you get shot. Yeah, right? but this is what I'm trying to say is the attitude is if, if everyone has a gun, then you feel like you should have a gun. Because you feel like you should have it. Yeah. Yes, indeed. Indeed. And that's why there's the ghettos and all that. But that's not only in America. It's mm -hmm. India. It's uh, Asia. It's no matter where you are. You are there's guns everywhere, literally. Um, mm -hmm. Except Denmark, you, it's rarely you find a gun there. From mm -hmm. the, there are some very big gangs. Yeah, they do have it, but it's not that Generally, much. Generally, it's quite a sort of safe and you know safe country, isn't it, Denmark? Well, it's it funny was, because this is what was, we hear. Uh, Sometimes you can't ago, believe yes. the media, but how the Brits see Denmark and how we're kind of you know we get told it's like one of the best places you can live, best quality of life, healthiest people, you know, best like one of the best places you know for schools, education. It's one of those like <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and pretty much Denmark's um, you know they've kept their economy pretty good, right? Yeah. Well. Well. Um, I, I wouldn't say that anymore. Um, there is happening a lot of violence over there now. Mm -hmm. um, and that's also with the police and all that again. Mm -hmm. um, that's why I will say Denmark is also losing this title as the happiest people in the world. Mm -hmm. Because I, I don't believe it. I don't believe it because so much crap is happening there. And many Muslims also say, I, I read on social media um, on the Danish side, they also said, I wish Denmark was how it was for 20 years ago. 
mm. because that's where it was good. Now it's shit. Like many many things is shit now. Okay, we can't change that. There has to be an, a, a revolution, and it will happen. It's the, the only matter of time is when, mm -hmm. because it will happen. And the whole thing is starting in America. Mm -hmm. That's why the big revolution gonna happen because of those shitty cops mm -hmm. killing innocent people. Didn't you see they they just kill kids? Oh no, yes. Yeah, they kill kids for no reason. Mm -hmm. Thirteen. Yeah, it's awful. I Thirteen know. kids just die because cops didn't like them. Mm -hmm. No, it's awful. Well, we all know that, yeah. you know, the cops can be very corrupt. I mean, everywhere in this country, everywhere. And yeah, but why, 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 why would you be somebody that uh, that should uh, is supposed to help you, right? Why would you well, be a leader? Thing, why yeah. would you be a but leader if you can't people are abusing take, take power. The, the, Unfortunately, the, exactly. this is the world we're in. People get into these positions and then they abuse power. And actually, they're supposed to be the ones protecting people. But, you and, know. And that's why mm. the revolution will happen. People will stand up. Uprising. Exactly. The, uh, <laughs> I was thinking about a film now um, where, where one does it and uh, kills all the cops and then everyone comes in. Now the revolution has begun and there's no escape from it. And it will happen worldwide. Mm -hmm. One country does it, everyone does it. That's how it is. Mm -hmm. Because even over here, Brits, Brits are so arrogant though, with the cops, yeah, right? They're like, no, oh, no, 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 we hate nobody, we hate nobody. We <laughs> I, this was uh, recorded live, right? And uh, why she got angry with the one, right? Mm -hmm. and because I'm black, and um, <laughs> then because she saw the camera. No, no, I hate no one. I'm, I like everyone. <laughs> I have no problem. <laughs> What a bitch, man. You know what? That's what I said. Yeah, you're right. They're abusing their power just because they have a badge. That's it. That's it. Mm -hmm. And the same thing is here. And George Reddy uh, had the balls to do it. I wish I had the balls to do it, but I can't. Mm -hmm. I, w I wouldn't But if bear. you were like a boxer and you were really tough and whatever, then would you take the initiative to do something? So I, I, I was him, a boxer. I was a boxer for five years. You'd feel that you were invincible, you know? If you're like very... If you're an amazing boxer and you know you can beat anyone, then actually that is a brilliant way, as long as you use it in the right way, it's a brilliant way to like bring about change. But anyway, I don't know enough about it, have to watch it, because who knows if he's gonna abuse you know, his power a lot or whatever, I don't know, and whether it's always good, or I don't know, but just from seeing this, it's an interesting topic anyway. I think you know? George would abuse the power only in the start to actually make it happen, mm -hmm. to, to actually yeah. get it well, done. Yeah, well that is, that's, yeah, that's, that's obvious, what that think. has to be done, but whether he... Um, and then, then he would be one, what, uh, one that, uh, you know, um, that says things... Would stand up for the people. Yeah, yeah. And, and make things actually happen, and um, be one of those that make sure the help comes to where it should be. Like, there shall be food. There shall be water, there shall be uh, um, all the criminals shall go away and blah, 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 you know? Mm -hmm. One that put justice. And that's what we need. Mm -hmm. So if we had, like, let's just say we had George Reddy everywhere. Mm -hmm. Everywhere. Like one that uh, controls everything and makes sure everything goes smoothly. Mm -hmm. What do you think this world would have been? Mm. Just think about it. Mm -hmm. Because many, many of the things when we look from India uh, films, right? We look at so many heroes, mm -hmm. heroic people, and we're just like, why are you not here now? Why are you not right here now? Mm -hmm. We should have that everywhere, if you just think about it. Mm -hmm. Because this world could be a better place. Mm -hmm. But this topic can go on forever. You can start the revolution. I could, but I don't want to die. Like this song. <laughs> yeah. No, no, I'm glad I'm not in America, because if I had to do it there, the couch would shoot me down. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, <laughs> but if <laughs> if I were there, I'd say, okay, give me an Uzi, give me a machine gun, give me this, 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 this. Now we begin, baby. <laughs> then I should just make my armor suit. <laughs> Revolution! Okay, okay, okay. I'm not in a film world, okay? Terminator. <laughs> okay. Get out of the dream world. Yeah, um, yeah um, I, I can't say anything else. This can go on forever. Yeah. No. Nope. It just looks really awesome, and I'd love to see that. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, George Reddy. Yeah. You got <laughs> Chris very yeah. excited. I was just watching the show. I was just letting you go off and one. I was like, yeah, yeah, I just let him, uh, you know, enjoy himself. <laughs> let me hear what you guys think. Comment down below. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, turn on the notification bell. Ding. So you can always stay tuned. When a new video drops. <laughs> Peace out. Bye.